Hello all, welcome to this video on SAP Supply Chain Management Basics. Uh, now in this uh, session, the objective is to see how to cancel a material document which is already posted. So I'm going to pick up a material document which is posted for an inbound delivery uh, and we will see how to cancel this and what and all things that we can see in the system. So for that, we are going to pick up the material document first. So let me go to MB03. So the metal document that we are going to pick up is 59000009. Going to press enter. So this is basically uh, for quantity one. And you can see here, this is a material T hyphen BW02 hyphen 01. And uh, this is a batch number 52000101108. And if you look at uh, the most important thing is here, the movement type, it's, it says 101 and it says plus. This means this is basically a goods receipt and it has been added to the inventory. So that means if I am canceling this, I would be expecting the reversal of the same quantity of the same material with the same batch number. However, the movement type should be 102 and instead of plus, it should be a minus. So let's see the movement type. Here you can see this is 101 is GR goods receipt and 102 is reversal of the GR. So that means here, if in this because of this middle document if it has added to the inventory now it should be subtracted from the inventory so that is the expectation so now what we are going to do is we are just going to cancel this now to cancel this what we have to do is the transaction code is mbst so i'm typing mbst and then i'm pressing enter so if you look at it has picked up my this is the metal document what i would like to cancel Five nine double zero double zero triple zero nine. So I'm going to press enter again. However, prior to that, if you look at there is one thing which is very important here. This is defaults for the document items. The reason for the moment. So here, if you look at here, you have lot many reasons. Like what was the reason? Why do you want to reverse this? So here it could be a wrong posting, it could be others, it could be spoiled, it could be poor quality, incomplete, damaged, delivered wrong production, not interested, and a number of things. You can create your own reasons as well. It depends on your business scenario, how and what reasons do they give or do they specify. Now in this case, I would be going with the wrong posting, let's assume. So I'll just press enter. So now I need to see that whether the details are going to be the same. So if you look at the quantity is one, very good and then the material st half and bw02 half and 01 the plant also seems to be correct yes it is picked up correct the storage location is being picked up correctly the batch is picked up correctly 52001108 and then if you look at the movement type is 102 and it is minus so the expectation what we had from system it has fulfilled properly so that means i mean it is reversing all the entries properly so now what we have to do, we just have to save this. So just say control S or post. It's one and the same. So you can see here that there is a new document which is being posted. Right? 59000010. So let's see um, what happens with this document. So I'm going into MB03 again. Stroke N MB03. So this is the material document number that we have just posted. All right, so you can see here it is the same quantity one, same material, same plan, same storage location, same batch number, and then the moment type is 102 minus. So, absolutely perfect. So, this is how you would be canceling the material document. Now, uh, trust me, when you would have done a post goods issue uh, or maybe a post goods receipt or any, any such thing, you know, it is always advisable that you always go through MBST instead of MyGo. Um, we will see in the upcoming video how to uh, cancel a material document through MyGo as well. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please do subscribe to our channel uh, for the latest upcoming videos. Thank you so much.